Oh my god. Are, are you ready? Like, are you ready? I'm so, so excited to just like start the album. I, I just can't wait. So, uh, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a magical day and this video makes it even more magical because I am going to do the album of different song of the sirens. <laughs> and I'm very, very, very excited because I, I loved their uh, new MV called Apple. That's why I am doing their song Apple first because it was first. I'm not sure what the second one's title was, but I picked The Eye of the Storm um, as the second song because I thought, yeah, let's put them together. <laughs> so I'm very, very excited. I, 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 I picked The Apple anyways because A, I'm doing two songs at a time, so it just balances the whole thing. I can do like two, two songs, else it would have been one song at the end alone, so it wouldn't be fair. And also because I want to learn what they mean. That's why it's a lyric reaction. I'm watching the lyrics down below so I can learn what it's actually like the meaning of the song, not just listen to the song. So it's very interesting. I just can't wait. Like, look at the images. We have the images of the last photo shoot, which is the photo shoot of the apples. And they all look gorgeous. You can see rainbows everywhere, gl glitter everywhere, like apples. So has two apples. <laughs> and then we have some flowers with MG. This a, a, a glittery, silver glittery apple. Shimmy has glitter all over her. Oh, Yuju in front is holding a, a, a glitter silver apple again, which is so cool. I like how they picked like those specific images. Now, to read the uh, lyrics, I do have to put it in front of some of the members. Ah, boy. It's always bad, but I usually just go with the middle. And it always seems to be Yuji and Inha because they're like the vocalists of the group. The main ones and the lead ones. So I kind of tend to just hide my, my favorite ones. Like Yuju is my bias, so Yuju always gets hidden by me. <laughs> Why? It's, it's not to pay attention to her. I know, I know that's head. Ha. I'm not supposed to give her so, so much attention. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, this is so cool. I love the whole witchy vibe. It's actually in the meaning of the song. I actually said in the MV that I was getting like Maleficent witchy vibes. And to talk about the witching hour, that's so cool. I also love how we have the pleasures in the lyrics and everything. Uh, temptation, like everything. The words that I get, it's just so cool to see what it actually provides you. The actual MV visuals and choreography and singing like the voices the power of their voices they provide all of this her their acting their facial expressions they give you all these words that they're using which is so cool because i was able to just tell all these without even knowing what the lyrics meant so it's just so cool to see it happen it's, it's already so interesting <laughs> Oh, 
I love how we have the glass beads mentioned as well, it's very interesting. I always love old references being. Beautiful high notes. I really, really enjoyed this one. I said what I wanted to say. I already know it because I've watched it so many times. <laughs> I really enjoy it and love it so much. Such a nice, powerful song, especially when you watch the MV and the transformation they get and everything. The story that has been told is just crazy. And honestly, I just want to get on with this next song because I just listened to it from the medley. So I have no idea from the highlight medley. So I've I've just got a glimpse of it and I'm not even sure which one it was from all of them <laughs> because it was written in Korean the title. So I don't know which one that was. So it's very interesting. I really enjoyed all of the songs written in Korean. So I'm gonna love this one. Oh again we're hiding in her and you do. <laughs> Oops. I know which one it is. I really like that one. I think it's the second one. I think it is. Oh my god, I really like this one. It's such a nice fast pace. Okay, I already love like the lyrics of like showing is it letting yourself out, letting yourself go. It links as well with the whole like thing of the album of and from the song the first one, Apple, of seeing the pleasure and unleashing it. And it's just so cool to see this song being close to it, but seeing such different melody. Uh that's like a fast paced song, but also kinda sweet and kind of my vibe to be honest that's why i really like it it's just this kind of sweet calm but powerful song that just gets you every time you listen to it and it's always able to like start fast and accelerate to greatness and mm, mm. just from the medley i knew that song would be good so i just got a glimpse of it so mm.
Okay, can I just say something? I know I'm pausing a lot. I like this calm part also too. But I usually don't really enjoy like uh, as much as I do the MVs because you get the visual and everything. But these songs, along with just a few past ones, I only have a few top favorite ones that are like just in the albums and not with their own MV. Like White, Windy Windy, Oh Vacation, and La Bum Bum. Like those, like there's like four songs. I just stated four songs. I can't really think of any other that don't have an MV and had a huge impact on me. But this, this has like a rhythm into it and could easily be an MV. All of their songs could easily be an MV. But for me, I just feel like this is just such a such an MV song for me. Like my feeling, like what I wanted to see in an MV, this would be like, it's, it, it's giving me like the, a bit of a past self of Jifren along with a bit of a future self of them. And it's very interesting to see this happening. And I think I'm adding this to my favorite songs that are not MVs and just an album songs <laughs> list. I don't know how long is this name, I need to shorten it, but yeah. <laughs> A little high note there, loved it. My favorite part is this one, I just love this rhythm, it's just so cool. an inspiring song just because of this line I'll find my way like I just love it it just gives you inspiration every time you hear it so that's why it would be one of my favorite songs and it ends with this line too oh that's so good that's so good uh, you have to let me know which one is it like in the order of the list because I would like to know and like link it and to making an order of uh, what is like the first song is the apple but then when you get that what happens next w what's the next song and how does it influence this storyline that happens through this album um other than that i enjoyed it so much i loved this song too and i like how i enjoy every song i hear from gfriend because they all have some uh, different feeling from them but they're all so powerful and genuine and different that you never get old they never get old or boring an album of theirs never gets um like bored i never get bored hearing them because they're all different uh kind of feel of songs from their music to their lyrics and meaning each and every song provides you with a different kind of boost, a different kind of power. Um, there are songs that will inspire you to create and become better. There are songs that will provide you with the strength that you need to achieve a goal. There are songs that will just uh, boost you up to be able to be honest and trust yourself to do what's right. And it's just very interesting to see them all in one of and just it's just magical all throughout. I'm just feeling okay, this is the mistake. <laughs> and I it just provides you with uh motivations. I motivation I suppose. Motivation motivation. <laughs> it just provides you with motivation as opposed to just be a better you. I I just 
get that feeling from them just because of their um their way of what they want to provide and they always because they have a <laughs> wow uh what's going on today I <laughs> I can't really explain what I want do I um because they want to no uh because they have the power to uh express what they want and they use this power to inspire and tell their story but also motivate us to be better to improve ourselves and become more powerful and just amazing human beings to improve our um uh, world and get ourselves like a new generation that is able to stand up to, uh, to for ourselves and be better i don't know if i explained this well but yeah so i do hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to like subscribe click the bell for notifications this little owl over here albert will be sending you and i'll see you guys next time in my next reaction where next week i am doing the other two songs you have to wait for them and see which are they are but yep i'm very excited to do them because i just love every one of every single one from their album i just saw the medley and i'm like i just want to listen to the medley over and over until I get to listen to the song, so. Bye-bye. <laughs>